Hey guys, I am feeling very festive, so we're going to do a fun little thing for NeoVim that is totally over the top and we don't need it at all, but we're going to use this plugin that allows us to have a duck that waddles around our screen, but because we're being festive, we might make it Santa, okay? So this is how we're going to do it, all right? These are where I manage all my plugins. This is my plugins.lua. So I'm going to do use and I'm going to state that it is this guy. If you're interested in trying this out yourself, the link is in the description for the repo. Uh, but basically we're just gonna use that. I'm going to add a little note here for anyone who uses my dot files. And then I've also got my key maps open. So what we're gonna do is, so nmap is a custom function that I created that basically just is for adding a new key map to normal mode. I'm gonna make this one leader, I'll make it leader semicolon. And then we'll add our command and it's gonna be Lua, Lua require. Uh, we gotta make this uh, single quotes, duck, dot hatch we can give it a santa okay there's the little santa i just grabbed that from unicode.org i'll also link that in the description if you'd like um so we'll set the hatch and then we'll tell it how quickly we want it to run around so i'm gonna make it just uh one i think uh that comma one and then that should be it we'll just add a little carriage return um basically enter and that should work tm uh, oh, right. I got to do uh, packer, packer install. Let's go into one of my projects or something with a little bit more code. And then here, let's try it out. So we'll do leader semicolon. So he just kind of walks around. <laughs> He just kind of, he just kind of walks around your code and you can spawn multiple. You can have an army of Santas in here. <laughs> anyway, this was just a fun little nerd activity for us to do over the holidays. So I hope you all have an incredible break, no matter whether you're celebrating Christmas or celebrating other holidays. There's also polar bears, so you can use a polar bear as well if you want, or a penguin or whatever. I just thought it was like a really fun little thing <laughs> to do for NeoVim. Um, also to kind of celebrate cleaning up my dot files. My dot files are up to date, by the way. So if you want to check those out, I will also link that in the description. I know that I get a lot of questions about that. And yes, there will be a follow-up replicate my NeoVim config video for my Lua setup. So keep your eyes peeled for that because it is coming. All right. Bye from me and the army of Santas. Okay. Bye. Bye.